So Vaughan Williams was inspired to write The Lark Ascending um, as a result of a poem by George Meredith. And of course this piece has now become a hugely popular, much loved core part of the violin repertoire. You often hear it played on Classic FM. And of course now the piece itself is more famous than the poem which inspired it. Vaughan Williams started this piece in 1914, but it wasn't first performed until 1920. So maybe the context of this music isn't just the English countryside and birds singing, but in fact um, the First World War. And you hear that in the lamenting quality of the music, um, a lost generation perhaps. The Lark Ascending is a very special and original composition. The violinist gets to play this beautiful cadenza at the, both the opening and the end of the piece where one can be totally free and I think it has to sound improvisatory. And of course the violin represents the lark climbing up into the stratosphere uh, in hopefully a very beautiful way. And it's terribly exposed so it is it's quite a lonely piece to perform, um, there's nowhere to hide at all. Um, but that's, I think that's part of what makes it so special and unique. And then when the orchestra eventually comes in, or in this instance it's going to be a, a string section, um, uh, you know, suddenly that sound that set, sounds so rich compared to the very stark, bare sound of a solo violin. Mm -hmm. 